I just heard something about a teacher strike. And I'm thinking, won't that cause disruption in the school year? Well, I spoke to my child's teacher and she told me that teachers don't want to strike. They vote to authorize the union to strike if the Board of Ed doesn't agree to make teaching and learning better. You know, like smaller class sizes and fair pay for teachers. If they don't want to strike, what is this fight I'm hearing about? And why hasn't the school board stepped up to hear the teachers' demands? Because the school board members are selected by the mayor, not elected by parents and teachers, and not representative of real people. 92% of kids in CPS are children of color, mostly working in middle class families. Well, that doesn't make sense to me. Of course not. All other public servants must be elected by people they serve. Why not the school board? Maybe if the board was made up of parents, teachers, and community leaders, they would do what's best for our children, and not just what the mayor wants. So exactly who is the school board? Bankers, business people, executives. What's wrong with bankers and business people on the board? Nothing, but they weren't elected. They were handpicked by the mayor. And the billionaires on there don't represent the families in CPS. They do what's good for the corporations and the mayor's political plans. Huh, I get it. I'm gonna talk to my neighbors and other parents about an elected representative school board. I mean, what else can we do? Well, I'm searching online right now. Here's a website about it, codechicago.org. That's C-O-D-E, Chicago, dot O-R-G. We need a CPS school board that represents our communities and our children. I'm with that. I mean, it's about time for it.